Hello riders, welcome back to another episode of London Rider. Rainy episode, just my luck. Um, I, it just started, it didn't rain all day. It just started to rain when I got off. So this is my luck. Um, so it's, I don't know if it's coming down now, but yeah, it keeps on going. But anyway, let's see how it goes with this rain. Um, why, why are these people stopping in the middle? Okay, anyway, I'm back in my usual and uh, favorite area, uh, Chiswick. And the, as soon as I got in with Deliveroo and Uber Eats, I got pending orders from both apps. So I'm gonna get now uh, one from uh, Sainsbury's assigned by Uber. So I'm gonna see how big it is and probably just do this quick one and then go and pick up the Deliveroo order, which is, seems to be pretty far. So I just want to give the Uber Eats one a go first and, and see how it goes. Let's go riders. Hello. Good one, Uber Eats collection. Oh, sorry. Uh, Lana T. Oh, yeah. It's just, there's two, huh? Two of them, yeah. Two of them, yeah. Yeah. Amazing, first order collected, uh, it could all fit in my bag, so it's not too bad actually. And, and the rain is coming down and the sky is clearing up, so let's see, let's see, hopefully it keeps like this. And also I like the, the sky to be clear because it will be lighter outside, uh, easy to see, easier to see. Let's go riders, let's go and deliver this. It's just three minutes away now, so it's not too far. Okay, riders, so I've been here before. Look how nice this place is. And yeah, this find, finding flats here is a nightmare. Um, there should be concierge available, but nobody's there at the moment. Also the direction tell me just the concierge, but I can't, so I need to find this place myself. I also found another rider. Lost asking me for directions. Maybe, yeah, ah, oh, maybe it's this one. Okay, luckily, I didn't manage to struggle too much finding a place, although the place is difficult, it's not easy. You need to go through many doors, and there is no connection, so it's difficult to uh, confirm the order, the, the number, confirmation number. Uh, but yeah, I love this place, this place is so nice. It's very, very nice place. Really, really like it. Imagine living here, and then you just come sitting, relaxing here by this nice garden. Beautiful. Okay, now I have one pending order from Deliveroo. Since there is nothing else to do, I'm gonna take that one. Although it's pretty far, it takes me pretty far, uh, but it pays five, five pounds something. Oh, let's go and have a look. Let's see, so the first order from Uber Eats gave me eight pounds for 24 pence. This one pays me 5.74 from when, when, Wendy's? But it's pretty far. I mean, it's taking me to Isleworth. It's pretty, pretty far. This is very far. But I'll take it in anyways. Uh, at least I have something to do. Uh, so I'm waiting here for the 
staff members of Buenos to bring me the, the order. Okay, order was collected. I uh, should be there in 21 minutes, which is 3.9 miles. But this is pretty, pretty far. And I don't know if it's even a fair, uh, a fair rate for this uh, kind of distance. Uh, I don't know if, if it's just because other riders are rejecting this kind of orders. And uh, basically I'm the first one who accepted it. Or if it's because simply rates went down. Uh, I, I started to believe that uh, a just yap is a myth where yeah, people claim that if you keep on rejecting lower paying orders then the, the algorithm starts giving you higher paying orders. I think it's not that. I don't know that also because there is no way to prove it. But I believe he's just yeah got a disorder for these miles for I don't know five pounds. You want it or not? No, I don't want it. Well, next one will be exactly the same price. The, the next person they they, they give the, the the order. So I don't don't know if it actually makes much difference. Anyway, let's go and deliver this. Okay, rider, second delivery completed. And since since I'm here, I realize I'm only four minutes from the Twickenham Isleworth um, Go Path Warehouse. So what I'll do, I just go there to see if if I get any delivery from from them. Also because uh, now going back to the let's say civilized area in Chiswick. I mean as civilized as in like yeah not not really civilized but like there are more shops there and restaurants here there is nothing well it will take me a lot of time so since I'm here I'd rather just take advantage of this and try to use this go path warehouse uh, I've been here once before and yeah got another straight away so let's see let's see what happens there and by the way, uh, it's 10 past 8 and it's already pretty dark. Also, yeah, being cloudy doesn't help because there should be still a bit, a bit brighter. But th that's because we are like now at the moment of recording this video is already September. So I'm starting to miss the summer now. Yeah, uh, working in summer, doing this job is lovely. But now, there we go, temperatures are dropping, I can feel it. It's still not horrible in terms of temperature, but yeah, the, the weather it starts, it, it started, it's raining now more often. It feels like the days are much, much shorter and feels a bit, yeah, it doesn't feel as nice as in summer. So, I'll, I'll miss summer. I had so much fun and now, yeah, September, here we are. We'll go back to cold, dark, rain and yeah, it won't be as nice cycling around, but that's what it is. Anyway, uh, yeah, let's go one minute away from this go path place. Let's go.